That's Radical Class with TG. Today we're going to be doing 2022 edition A Lion. So we're going to start off with the We're going to make the top of the head first. Well, the top, but not the top. Um, so we're going to draw a little slope. I'll draw it in the middle a little bit. And then I'm going to make it a little longer. And then, we're go now, we're going to draw the nose. So I'm going to a little um, half of a circle, but not really good. You can do that. And then, to make sure this looks like a nose, I'm going to erase right there, and we're going to make a half of a circle going in, and then we're going to keep on going with a little line here. And then, we're going to draw the mouth. So, I'm going to we're going to make a little indent right here, and then we're going to go back out here, and then we're going to make a little line uh, right here, and then we're going to make that turn right here. You can kind of see the face of the lion forming. There. Go up like that. And then we're going to come back down a little bit. And then keep going and then stop right there. And we're going to start on the main. So we're going to go like, uh, go from like the bottom of the face and we're going to go out. Like, we're going to make half of a circle going out here. And then we're going to make an indent here. And we're going to go out again. And then, I'm gonna go back in like this, and then on the other side, top, and we're gonna make the main at the top, and we're gonna connect it at the bottom here. And then we go down or align up this way. We're gonna curl it here, curl it, and then we're going to. We're going to make it do like that. Okay. And we're going to make the main end here. I'm going to do like, we're going to make a little slope going down this time. And then we're going to make a point right there. We're going to make it go down, make a point right there. You can kind of see the line coming together and you can see like the main so we're gonna draw like a bit of an S which it kind of looks like an S so so I'll show you like we're gonna go down like that and then we're gonna go like that and then it's gonna be like that but it looks more like a question mark so comment down below if it looks like a question mark or an S okay so let's get on to it the, the lion so the next thing you're gonna do is you can see um, that that there's in, in, like a slope down right here. So instead of uh, drawing in the slope here, we're going to draw below the slope. So we're gonna draw down here, like right about there. I'm gonna draw a little line down here. Okay, that's good. And then we're going to draw half circle. We're gonna draw like a hill, but a sideways hill. So we're gonna do hill sideways. But it's gonna be a slight bump right there. It's gonna be really slight. All right. Okay. Now we're going to draw a slope again. We have lots of slopes in this lion. We go down like that, and then come back out like that. And we're drawing the foot now. And we're going to draw half of a circle here, and then stop like an oval. And then we're gonna keep going down. So we're gonna stop there. Then, we're going to right where that slope is, and then we're going to draw the other side of the leg, or the drawn side of the leg. And where that slope was at the top of it, we're going to draw the leg. Draw that line, and then we're going to stop like we did last time. But this time, we're not going to go in, we're going to go out. So we're going to go a little out on this side. Out. Okay. Then we're going to go in like the other one. 
and we're going to stop it. Okay. So now we can do this right now. We're going to draw the body part, and we're going to go. We're going to go out a little bit. The other leg is going to be up in the air, and you're going to see most of the foot. So we are going to draw right in the corner. We're going to do like right there. We're going to draw a little slope of heel, very slight hill, and very light, just like that. And then we're going to draw the other side, exactly like that, except we're going to curve it in more, just like that. And then we're going to go out for the ball. <laughs> so now, after we've gotten the other leg, we're going to finish off with the body. Now, we're going to go up to the top here, and we're going to go with the back here, and this time we're going to go down, last time we went up at the body, at the belly, and we're going to go down this time. So, we're going to make that slope down like that, and then up here we're going to make a little slant here like that, and that's going to be a little part of the main, like on the other side of the back. We're going to keep on going like that, we're going to stop there. Now we're going to make the hind legs. So what I usually do is, I make a little hump here, and then I go down like a raindrop. And then, instead of going the whole raindrop, I stop and I go down. And then, down. Same thing as the other way, and then make the foot like yeah. We're gonna stop like that, and we're gonna go up to the back. So now we're gonna draw the rear part of the Orion. So we're gonna go down like that, and we're gonna draw a slant through the whole thing. So now we're going to start from uh, the part where okay. So now we're gonna start from here, and we're going to draw a little line in. From going in, 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 and then we're gonna go out a little bit here, and that foot, and then we can erase this line right there. We're gonna draw the other leg, and so this line is in the motion of walking right now, so the other leg will be back here, about to push up. So we're gonna draw. Um, so now we're going to draw the, a half of a triangle. So we're going to go down like that. And then this one is going to so we're gonna go down like that. And this is kind of like a circled triangle. So we're going to make a little hump like that going down. And then we're going to make this leg going down. Okay. Okay, so now we got that. And we're going to go closer together here like that. And we're just going to go in. In. And then there's your foot, and then we're going to fix up here a little bit. So, we're going to erase. Um. So now we're going to start off with the tail, with a triangle. So for we're going to stop like that, and then... Make a really long line going up. Like that. Out wide. Out wide. And then we're gonna do a point right there. There you go. A big point. So now we're gonna make all the details. This is the inside of the foot here. So we're not going to draw toes, nails. So what I did is I made little lines to see that the leg is curling. Then I also put the paw. See those dots here? I colored them in. And there's one right down here. So. Now, the next thing, we're going to make the face. Of course, we need a face. We're going to draw the mouth. So 
for drawing the eyes. So I'm gonna draw right here. Don't like an eyebrow, but it's not. So when I see pictures of lions or lions, I always see them with stern faces. So I'm gonna draw mine with stern face. That's why it looks like it's mad. Yeah. What I'm gonna do to the mane here is I'm going to shade the mane in. So I'm gonna darken the mane. Okay, so now we're gonna add some whiskers. So we're gonna do one, two, three. That's good. So I shaded in the lion and it looks pretty good. And I also outlined it with a marker and a really thin marker. If I did it with a thick marker, then it would have been too clunky. So I did it with a thin marker. Okay, that's the end of our lion. You can put um, other details on your lion if you want. Anything you can think of that I did miss. You can put, go ahead and put it on there. Hope you liked this video. Make sure to subscribe and like. And like only if you like it. Bye. <laughs>